that voice, that was yours. But it doesn't matter. Your potential won't change anything now or then. I'll prove it. This is just a fool now. What's up, guys? It's Rocky here. Welcome back to Gaming with Cosplay. And for those of you who guys don't know, I upload Dragon Ball Legend content every single day. I'm going to switch up the intro just a little bit more to give you guys a heads up at the beginning of what it is this channel is actually all about and stuff like that. Anyways, I do upload content on the daily on here as best as I can uh, with my current situation here. But we're going to jump into the story mode here because something incredible is happening. So if you guys don't want any spoilers or anything like that, it, this is, video is different than my normal stuff. We are going to talk about what I just experienced and how I felt literally as soon as it happened. Whew, oh boy. This one right here. So we're going to go ahead and do the fight and then we'll talk on the top of that. Alright, let's go. My Gogeta. Anyways, this right here. I'm going to skip to the part until we, we see the, the part that I'm talking about. Most of you guys should know. Also, if you like I said, if you guys don't want any spoilers, stop this video right now. Finish this, this uh, story mode part 3 in this book chapter. Finish it and then join me back here and we'll discuss it in the comment section below about what you guys think and how it's finally about damn time about this. Alright, now let's get into it. I'll be right back guys. Vincenzo and you is finally starts to awaken in an era where everything is already over. You can still get a lot stronger. You have the potential. That that's I get it now. That voice, that was yours. But it doesn't matter. Your potential won't change anything now or then. I'll prove it. After all, we're Saiyan twins. Finally, we get a Saiyan twins storyline, guys. I've been waiting on Dragon Ball. Hold on. I got, got some uh, sweatiness going on. I had to hurry up and get that done because I wanted to just do this for you guys. Plus, I have been not posting consistently with my legend things. Anyways. And he's die shallow. But finally, a storyline of twin Saiyans. This is about damn time. This has happened. I've been waiting for a storyline like this. And we get it for Dragon Ball Legend. So thank you guys at Bandai for making a storyline like this. And also giving us the same, almost the same continuity, but doing little differences in the timeline where things just connect properly. Like with the Bora jumping in earlier in the story and... Stuff like that like we're going on the same path but in a different way and it's like a new story it's it's revitalizing to playing something like this and also from my experience of playing all the dragon ball games from freaking budokai to sagas to battle 22 and battle 22 yeah wh whatever the final battle 22 or whatever there was the gt1 and then there was the, the one on playstation all those playing all those games from then to now and legacies of goku's and all that stuff it's just really really damn cool to be able to continue a storyline but just literally lift it up in different ways that you don't expect and i don't know it's just awesome why tell me why and we finally get the name drop right here giblet i think that's the only way i can think of giblet so we got shallot and giblet saiyan twins so we are going to get an insane storyline between the two characters to continue and with Kamehameha Khan literally in freaking six, seven days. It's just like this is a great time to kind of bring this up and have it ready to go for Kamehameha Khan because this is just amazing. If you guys are going to Kamehameha Khan and you guys see me there, I will be vlogging the whole thing. So chat with me, hang out with me. We can... Uh, I'd love that for to do, to do that. So let's go ahead and fight Giblet. Now that we have a name, Saiyan Twin. It was right there the whole time. That's just awesome. I will, to begin to be honest. From the beginning, I thought it was a different timeline. Shall it? Once we started to play the game a little bit more. But no, it is not a different timeline. Shall it? And he's got some power, man. He's got some power. And another thing is, too, I had a summoning video ready for you guys, but for some reason something happened during the recording in, on the Bandai side of it, the game. And I don't know what it was, but I literally could not 
summon. Like it froze on my multi summon, and I couldn't do anything else. Literally, it kind of upset me a little bit because that was a whole video wasted. I didn't get anything crazy. I got Extreme Trunks, a new character from the GT Saga, so that's really good, and I'll have a video for him showcasing soon. I don't know exactly when, but I will have it. I've got some other good news that I'll share with you guys after this, but uh, let's, let's beat Gilbert now. And also, this week, I will be bringing uh, how to, to farm uh, Gotenks medals and the best way to do it and how I have been planning to do it ahead of time because it'll be pretty much the same strategy for everything but I want to do it specifically for the characters so people who are looking for that specific character don't go to like the sparking free to play Goku and look up until how to farm that because I actually farmed this one a little bit different than the other one so there will be another video on that too just giving you guys a heads up of what's coming this, this weekend and throughout this week giveaway why giveaway why are you doing this so it seems like he's starting to just shower, starting to naturally um, remember things and respond. And so not only that, but it seems like they have a twin connection from, I guess their heritage or whatever it is they have going on. I'll farewell the blood of the defeated that runs through my body and return things to to the straight and narrow. The job for me is real long. You're wrong. I'm not a loser. We are not some gutless losers. Hmm. So there, those are going to be your last words, huh? Well then, prove it to me. Not that you stand a chance. And I like the subtle difference that Ch uh, Giblet has in his hairstyle than Shower. It's just enough to give him his own personality, and he has more of an arch in his eyebrows. As you guys can tell, more aggressive. <laughs> it's over. You'll, you'll, I'll turn you to ash. To ash. Give lit. And see right here, something's wrong. Something is wrong with this man. Because he's shaking. And he doesn't want to be touched, so he's trying to. Shao is trying to comfort him into figuring out what's wrong with him. And he's saying, You are my enemy. So something is being forced onto Giblet to make him make these decisions. The curse is why, why Giblet wait. So we have that. And we're going to leave it there. I'm going to continue playing the story. I've only done it. I'll show you guys where I've, I've, had, I've got two. So I've got to chapter or book seven, chapter five. Now I'm going to continue playing it off screen. And if something comes up, we'll discuss it in a different video. But I wanted to focus on just that part in the series. And questions and all that stuff that we can talk with you guys so just let me know in the comment section below and that's gonna wrap it up for today's video if you guys enjoyed today's video make sure you like subscribe and favorite share with a friend or two or three as always live free work hard and based on join me tomorrow for some more dragon ball legends content i've got some stuff scheduled now and everything should be hopefully coming back together staying on a consistent freaking schedule is the hardest the hardest thing that I can do, but I am trying my best to do that with the time that I'm allowed here at home with two kids, fiance, work, studio apartment, as you guys should know by now, if you guys didn't, that's my little situation, but it is rough, it is tough, but I'm trying to do my best, so stick around as we continue to progress on making this my full-time career, and thank you guys so much for helping me hit 900 subscribers, guys. The, the importance and the meaning of that is just incredible. I, it took me nine years to do that on my main channel of, that's what I call it now, but it used to be a dance channel, and that is just incredible. Thank you guys so much for taking your time out of your day to enjoy the content that I post on this channel. So much more stuff to come, so much more stuff in the works. Again, thank you. I am so humbled and appreciate every single one of you guys who subscribe, and I try to comment as soon as possible on all my videos to you guys as well. Bye, guys. <laughs>